For more update, please subscribe Gossip America News YouTube channel and press the bell button. Everyone knows Erica Jane is a diva, but an insider reveals the terrible truth about her horrible behavior in Vegas. Erica Jane was preparing to make a comeback after facing public attention over her separated husband's alleged illegal activities. Bravo viewers are still divided on how much she knew about Tom Gerardi's alleged deception. However, she was dropped from at least one criminal prosecution in 2022, according to People magazine. The Bravo star will finally get a chance at atonement in 2023 with the Las Vegas residency. BT at All on Blonde had a short run at the iconic House of Blues in Las Vegas. Erica Jane sang several of her best-known songs, including XXP and Dollar IV. The residency ended in December, but if you missed it, Bravo cameras filmed the documentary to air next month. The two-hour special Erica Jane. Bet it all on Blonde Airs on Bravo on March 6 and stream on Peacock the next day. Las Vegas is lovingly known as Sin City, but did Erica Jane take it a little too literally? That's what one waitress from the venue allegedly told a Bravo fan who was in Vegas and asked if Erica was still performing. She wasn't, but the waitress was more than happy to spill some tea about Erica's alleged bad behavior. The Bravo fan shared the hot gossip on Reddit. According to the insider, all the employees hated working the nights of Erica Jane's residency. In fact, the source claims the bartenders said it was the worst show they've ever seen at the House of Blues. What does Erica Jane allegedly do that's so bad? The House of Blues employee claims the Bravo celebrity demanded security stand at the elevator in the restaurant so no one could approach her. The waitress compared Erica Jane's diva behavior to that of iconic singer Santana, who they claim never asked for security to keep fans away. Thanks for watching this video and please subscribe our Gossip America News YouTube channel for more update news.